there still seems to be a lot of debate on whether or not Jews who follow Judaism are still going to be saved just based off of their beliefs. Well, I brought up I am the way, the truth, and the life. But let's bring up another passage, just to kind of bring home the point. So let's look at John 5, 37 through 47. And it says, And the Father who sent me has himself borne witness about me. His voice you have never heard, his form you have never seen, and you do not have his word abiding in you. For you do not believe the one whom he has sent. You search the scriptures because you think that in them you have eternal life, and it is they that bear witness about me, yet you refuse to come to me that you may have life. I do not receive glory from people, but I, do, but I know that you do not have love, the love of God within you. I have come in my Father's name, and you do not receive me. If another comes in his, in his own name, you receive him. How can you believe when you receive glory from one another and do not seek the glory that comes from the only God? Do not think I will accuse you to the Father. There is one who accuses you, Moses, on whom you have set your hope. For if you believed Moses, you would have believed me, for he wrote of me. But if you do not believe his writings, how will then you believe my words? Okay, so the point here is, who was Jesus talking to? He wasn't talking to the Gentiles. He didn't say, hey, write this down for the Gentiles. No, he was talking to the Jews. Jesus made it clear. Even Jews needed to believe in him to be saved. There's no debating that with scripture. 